said, well, all it does is some very simple things. It says, K through 8, we're talking very sensitive issues. Uh, I don't think those issues need to be introduced until children are older. This clearly is not going to stop a child if they have a question asking a teacher. This doesn't stop if there's a counselor issue, um, a serious issue that they need to talk to a counselor about. It doesn't stop that. But if there is something where we're talking the health or safety of a child, I think parents should be involved in that. I think parents are the ones who should decide when an issue is age appropriate, when a child is old enough to grasp con uh, complex sexual issues. Uh, and I, that's all this bill does. It says in very young ages, we're going to leave that up to the families to decide when it's age appropriate, what is age appropriate, and what they want to tell us to their children about. Well, the guidance counselor were to say, <clears throat> the child is gay. And the guidance counselor says, okay, I think that it's, this is a dangerous behavior if the guidance counselor surmises that. So the guidance counselor can go to the parent and say, yeah, hey, I, I wouldn't think. say, and you're asking me, I would say being gay is not a dangerous activity. The act of homosexuality is very dangerous to someone's self, health and safety. You think homosexuality is radically dangerous? I think there are health issues, there are serious health concerns. You're talking about an activity that uh, can be deadly. In what way? Well, AIDS kills people. But it's not limited to homosexuality. It is not, but I think it's, uh, it's, it passes at a 50 times higher rate in the act of homosexuality than through heterosexuality. Uh, what do you think about the... Um, and that's, those are CDC numbers. The, the title is Classroom Protection Act. What does that mean? Well, it just says, hey, we're going to, some topics, we're going to protect and leave those topics for the parents. We're not going to have a teacher with an agenda one way or the other, start pushing out what they believe is right and appropriate. Why give it a title? Well, so people don't give it wrong titles and that uh, that do not clearly illustrate what the bill does. Meaning, like the "Don't Say Gay." Yeah, I thought that I thought that was mis mistitling it. <coughs> you know, because there was no ban of words. So, but it I guess it got you a lot of press. It got me press, but you know, it's not accurate. You know, <laughs> I, I hated. You know,